Alright, hey guys, welcome back to Heaven Dust 2. Um, I was going to backtrack here a little bit and try to open up more of those, uh, what, Nautilus crates. And we also have a key that I think we can unlock a door inside the, uh, actual laboratory or wherever we are. I don't, I don't know what it is. I think it's a laboratory. Alright. Yeah, we need the Nautilus key right here. Shotgun ammo. Great. Awesome. Glad I came back for that. Okay. Um, yeah, that... Remember that series of locked doors back here that we've been opening slowly one at a time? I think that key goes here. And is the key gone now? Yeah, the key had disintegrated. Okay, what's in here? A wrist bag. Okay, so we get more storage slots. Nice. You see the wrist bag on the character, though? No. I think it said wrist bag, didn't it? Or was it waist bag? Because he's got one on his uh, leg. I'm not sure. Okay. Um. Anyways, let's go ahead and save our game here because why not? And now, what were we doing? We had the, uh, the fishtail key. Um, we unlocked two doors, but we can get into that security room, right? No. Alright, we still need the prison guard key, but we can unlock the door to the old research building, or the old building research room down here. Um, I'm hoping we find the guard key in there. If not, I'm sure we'll find like a puzzle or something that leads us to that area. If I can find my way out of here, not paying attention where I'm going. Alright, here we go. Now we've got to go all the way back up here to the the guard room where, uh... I don't remember her name. K? Kylie? For some reason I want to say it starts with K, but I don't remember what her name was. But she's standing right outside of the room where we need to be, so... We don't have the key to get into that room now. We have to go down a little further and use the fishtail key on a door that's just past the guard room. Alright, we got zombies down here. No big deal. Unlimited ammo makes it easy. And we got a Nautilus to open anyway, so let's do that. Alright, open this. Alright, let's get in Fire grenades. Great. Yeah, what's her name? Oh, it is Kay. Okay. I wasn't sure. I thought that's what it was, but I wasn't sure. Okay, let's, uh... Is it this door? No, this is where we need the guard key. The fishtail actually opens this one. Like that. And now that key disappeared, right? Yeah, because we used it. I do like how that happens. I do like how that happens as in they, they take the key from you when you're done using it. So you know you can get rid of it and you don't have to like keep holding on to it. Have you never been in here? What the hell? It doesn't look like I have. Because I know zombies do fun, but usually not those loaded things. Yeah, I've been in here. These doors are open. Uh, yeah, I've definitely been in here. Okay. Um, how do we do this, though? When that detects me... Okay. Huh. Okay. Okay. Um. I'm a little confused. This makes fire grenades. Yeah, this makes electric grenades. Let's see, how do we do this? Or was I supposed to kite the zombies in here? 
So as I open this and I just stand over here. Um, hmm. Okay. That's weird. Yeah, when it senses me, when these motion things sense me, it closes. Huh. Yeah, I can get by this first one. If I run down the wall over here. I wonder if there's lasers that I just can't see. I'm guessing that's what it is. But I don't know how to... Um... Yeah, I was hoping to put up smoke and you could see the laser shining through it. Huh. Well, shoot. How do we get through there? That's a good question. And this is open, but there's nothing in here. Yeah, I did pick something up in here. I don't remember what I picked up, but it wasn't, it wasn't anything important, I don't think. There are crates everywhere, but use for experiments, a fuel, we got spores, deer mount, catalyst to reactivate a inhibitor. Okay, a deer mount, a lighter, a folding shovel, enough painkillers to kill a horse. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what to do with the, uh, that room. I know we gotta get in it. That's for sure. Because we go down this side. Yeah, because it automatically closes. But if we just stop, no. You run down the side here. Run down this. Okay, it worked that time. That's weird. Okay. Alright, well, we figured it out. Great. Um, let's see. More ammo. Can I kill you guys before the door opens? Thank you. Out of ammo? I don't think I am. Not out of ammo, just you need to reload. Cause I got plenty of ammo. More than plenty of ammo. Alright. Shoot these guys. Is that all that's in here? Everyone else is behind doors, I think. More gunpowder. What's this? Oh, I thought it was going to open all the doors. Alright, uh, researchers note. The good thing is we have discovered the electric shock. The electric shock can loose the exoskeletons. Yeah, okay. Well, we need to move this so we can get to that button. Like so. Oh, no, now I'm stuck. Okay, move over here. There we go. Electric grenade. Okay. We're gonna need the electric grenade for something. I'm not sure what. I'm guessing that zombie there. Because there's a lot of grenades and stuff in there. And that's a generator too, isn't it? Yeah, it's a generator that needs to be grenade. Okay. Um, can I mess with any of this? It doesn't look like it. How do we open this door? That's a good question. Is right now we're stuck in here. What do you mean I'm out of ammo? Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Okay, that just... 
gets us out of there. No, oh man, now I gotta do this again. Okay. But I don't think we need to be in here because I don't know how to open these doors. Unless... Hold on. Uh-huh. Oh gosh, really? That's not gonna work, is it? Oh, now I'm stuck stuck. Okay. Can I go around? No, it can't go around. Okay. <sighs> I wanted to put it in right here so we can walk up this onto the box and then across, which is what we need to do, but I need to figure out how to move the box here. Maybe. Is that close enough? I don't think it is. No, it's it, now we're stuck. Okay. Okay, this is good. This is good. Let's try this. Alright, and then this way. Like that. Just like that. Great. Alright, another puzzle down. Um, what's this? There seems to be something inside. Yeah, we need to throw an electric grenade at it. Um, maybe? Okay, we needed to do that, but, um, how about this? Yes, and there's the guard key. All right, we got it. Is there anything in these cells? That one's clear. How about this? That one's clear. How about over here? Nothing in this one. Really, it's just a bunch of zomboys? And this one. Really, there's nothing. Huh. Okay. Um, let's see here. There you go. Uh, well, now we can go, I guess, out of here. I, I think we're done in this area. We have to, uh, give that chick the guard key, but first I want to use the guard key on this door. What would have happened if I gave her the key before using it on this? I guess you just don't get in here. It looks like you might be able to come back in here anyways. That automatic door opens from this side of the wall, that's funny. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's go around and see if we can't give her the key and see what happens. We'll save it. Go talk to Kay. Prison guard key. Well, I gave it to her. I can try to escape by myself. Before that, Steve, I have to ask something about yourself. Go ahead. I have a friend, Iris. She said she was one of the partners. Uh, could you be the same Steve? Iris. Can't remember anything about Iris. Why? What happened? Could be more of a side effect from the freeze chamber. Alexander said my memory will come back soon. Freeze chamber? He kept you in a freeze chamber? Uh, yeah. Do you remember where you were before you got put in there? That I remember clearly. I was at the Stardust Research Center Mansion. What the hell? Alright, that should be it. Can you try to remember something about Iris? Mm, no. How about this? You go deal with Alexander's request. Maybe we'll get your memories back by then. Okay. And he wanted... He wants me to find his, like, prosthetic hand or something, doesn't he? I don't know what he wants from me. I think he wants his hand or something. I don't remember. Uh, well, now where do we go? 
I have no idea where to go now. Let's see. We've got locked doors up here. Yeah, but we need a prosthetic hand to get into there. And where did he say the hand was? In the botany lab. And the botany lab is up there. Okay. So we've got to go back to the old building hall. Stay on the first floor, it looks like. Oh, yeah, because we shot that crate down. Okay, yeah. All right. I don't know where we're going now. This is great. All right, go up the steps. In here. Yeah, stay on the first floor. And that crate should be up here on the ground. I shot it down. Fix all the crooked pictures because it turns the wall, apparently. Alright, give me this. Alright, we have this. Put this here. And all the doors open. Beautiful. Alright. What do we got? Alexander's diary. Um, right, I'm not, I don't want to read all that. <laughs> Hit this button. What's that do? It just glitches the door out. That's all it does. Alexander's diary again. In short, to kill an infected giant plant, I need catalyst, the inhibitor in equational virus. Okay, that, that sounds alarming, but you know what? I've got like half of that. I think I, I think I have two of those three things, don't I? I don't like how this is moving. Come in, Steve. Uh, yeah, I'm in the waste disposal area. A giant stem blocking the door. Can't get past it. Oh, I have... Alex is talking to me. Okay. Are you there? Yes, I'm here. You were just talking to me. What do you mean? Listen, if you want to pass through the corridor, you have to destroy that plant. Uh, I know. Don't panic. Find my diary. I've written down how to kill it. You need to gather several ingredients. Yeah. The virus, catalyst, and inhibitor. Where's the inhibitor? Are you going to kill me if I walk over here? Okay, so I just put them in one at a time, it looks like. Okay. Um. Equational virus. Catalyst and inhibitor. Oh boy. Alright, what do we have? I have a catalyst, the virus, where's the inhibitor? I don't have an inhibitor. No, I do not have an inhibitor. Okay. Yeah, I think you need the inhibitor to combine all this stuff. Use the virus. Use the catalyst. No, I need the inhibitor. Huh. Well, I don't know where the inhibitor would be. I'm going to look it up because, you know what, why not? I'm allowed to do that. Okay. Heaven, dust, two, where's that, a 
mitotic something, I don't know, inhibitor. I know I'm saying that wrong, but I don't care. Um. Hmm. Let's see. Um, let's see. Can't really find anything on it. We've got, uh, the Alex's Diary, the radio, but then you gotta. Okay, he's got both of them. How do you already have them? I don't understand where you found it. Um, excuse me? I don't know what room he's in. Okay, I missed something big time here. Where the hell is he at? I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to figure out where this guy's at. And I can't tell. I really don't know where he is. It says old building H. Old building H, that's the hall, right? Okay, so he's up there in the old office. Okay, so let's backtrack a little bit. I think I missed something. Missed a room. It's right up here on the, the bottom. Um, okay, let's see if we can't get in there. Alright, let's go back up here. It's this right here. This hallway right here is where he went. He was in that room. How did he get in there? Alright, so apparently what I missed was back in this swimming pool that glowing thing over there I didn't grab and you, that's a key piece to what you need. It's a deer mount. And what that's going to do is allow us to mount my deer head On the wall over here, I think, I hope. I didn't see him do this part. Okay, and this door opens. This is all I watched. This is all the farther that I have watched. What does this do? Oh, it turns that. Okay, it turns the staircase. Okay. That's good because that's where we're supposed to be, right? I think. Alright, let's walk over here. Like this. Alright. Hoffman's diary. What's in here? Shock absorber. I think both of our pistols already have that, didn't it? Okay, that's the way out. That didn't do anything for me. Oh, I think, uh... Do I have any wood planks to maybe make a bridge up there? Oh no, let, yes I do. Okay, good. Let's see if I can lay down a wood plank and create a crossing. Because there's wood right here. Okay. Alright, making progress. Alright. Another diary. Going here. I was expecting zombies, but it's a safe room. Okay, cool. Um, go ahead and save it. Looks like another Hoffman diary right there. I don't care. If you want to read it, <laughs> pause the video. 
We need the lighter. Okay. The lighter. And we're gonna light this candle. Oh, I'd say that, that moved, but the wall is still there. What the hell? Okay. Another Hoffman's Diary. Heavy pistol ammo. The door. Okay. Um, it's gonna be another boss fight. So let's do this. Let's put all this in here. Go ahead and grab some painkillers. And save it. I'm gonna walk over there and hopefully kick his ass. No promises, but here we go. Yeah, okay. I mean, these fire grenades are just... I think I broke them. He didn't like being on fire is what he is, I think. Yeah? I don't know if I'm hurting him now. Oh, okay. He was easier than zombies. What the hell? I, I know I'm playing with unlimited ammo, but Jesus Christ. Alright, what's in here? Shotgun ammo. Perfect. What's in here? Alright. Cool. I think that's what we just put into him, right? Maybe? Put into that, not him, the plant. Oh god, okay, well, save the game real quick. Got zombies. They're harder than the boss because they actually keep moving, kind of, after you shoot them and they're on fire. The boss just fucking stood there like a dumbass. Okay, um, this way? I think it's this way. Yeah, it is. Yeah, we go back to the waste disposal room entrance and we use this uh, injector on him yes just like this and he should be dead right we should be able to like walk past him okay explore the botany lab and find his prosthetics Okay. Why do I feel like this is dangerous? Probably because it is. Uh huh. All right. Note to self: Do not let concrete fall and hit you in the head. Got it. And he's gonna do that. Okay. Well, that's just gonna... You're annoying. Okay. Alright. Now he's gonna... Okay, concrete. Punch. He makes that thing. And it killed me. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay. Okay, got that. Rocks. Okay, and that, and that, and that hurts. Okay, let's try healing. 
Alright, it is really hard to tell if you're hurt. Because, like, your... The stuff on the side of the screen turns red, that white border. And it's not exactly easy to see all the time. If you look down your, at the left corner at the picture of Steve, you'll get like a bloody face, kind of like, uh, kind of like Doom, the character from that does. You can tell he's hurt, but that's really the only way you can tell. I want to pretend these grenades are hurting him, but you can't tell. Oh god, okay. Yep, yep, yep. Ow, alright. Then we take like one more hit, then we gotta use painkillers again. Stand over here, please. Wait, we'll take another one. Okay, using this. Ow. I don't, I, I don't know if I should be using a grenade launcher or using like a, a better gun. Well, it's not going to be a better gun, but like a gun with like actual bullets. Okay, grenade launcher for this thing. Even though I'm going to die because I don't have any more painkillers. Okay, alright, alright, well, this is just annoying. Ow. I really don't think these fire grenades are hurting him. And I'm gonna die next hit right there. And come on. Okay, what are you doing next? Nope. Ah. Okay. Ah. I'm gonna end this video here. I'm gonna pick him up next video, and we're gonna defeat him because that's. He's tough, what the hell? Alright, whatever. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.